You son of a bitch. You son of a bitch. I can't. <laughs> Hello, everybody. Hello, everybody. What's going on? Oh. <laughs> oh. That was the most unique way ever to start a life. <laughs> All broke ass diets, guns, pizza operator, Kathleen, Shady, Dr. Drew, Skynet, Skynet, Keith, Work Knife. Uh, I'm just saying hi, real quick. Marco, Wasabi, Marco. Keith, and I freak. Don't Keith and I freak so confused. He was. Less knives, Donnie. How you doing? What's up, Donnie? Donnie B. Kaleidoscope. Um, knives are lives. Is this another St. Patrick Olight sales stream? Heck no. <laughs> we started with farts and Arnold. <laughs> You're Arnold definitely in the wrong place. <laughs> Dr. Dude. Dr. Drew. R. Shear. Joseph S. Drew uh, in the house. Knives are live, or knives are life, and other people. I think I speak for Stevie, but we don't uh, shill for companies just to get money, which, you know, it's fine if you do, whatever. We only show for people we like. Like Keith the Knife Freak in Azulu. And, you know, we get nothing from that. We just like to. Pushed our friends. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> but cheeks one word, he you spread them apart. <laughs> That's how we feel about shilling. Robert Douglas and some dude. Some dude, what up? Cool. Edge. Hello. That's kids. I was super confused. <laughs> About what? What did I miss? I was so confused. Working on some folders, you know? Yeah, yeah. You know. Funk Wonky! We got one moon. Funk Wonky, hey! Funk Wonky! Oh, Speaking of Funk Wonky, Ooh. got my one moon shirt on. Doom! Nice to have us kids. Or rather, we should say, Ooh. Oh, yeah. <laughs> the bulge of doom. I'm gonna see that mofo at Fisticuffs. It, it's on at Blade Show. Heck oh. yeah. Scott. The dude wants smoke. He got smoke. Me too, buddy. ENG. Scott and. Yeah, a little musky in here. <laughs> Nemo! I'm Hello, Michael Morgan. How was everyone doing? I'll be honest, I took uh, two Benadryl and uh, it took me a long time to shake it off. I was asleep an hour ago. I could not stay awake. But, I'm uh, all hopped up on date oil. Yeah. I slept uh, four and a half hours last night and I've been packing and shipping all day. The night sedge. How do you get that background in your lives? I've never done a live, but when I finally do, I'd like the background to be something other than my rusty freezer. Okay. Hang on. <laughs> uh, so there's. Are you on. Do you have a StreamYard account? I was going to show them. Here, go to StreamYard. This is what it looks <laughs> like. What you do is you go to brand over here. Uh, right here, add background. Just find yourself a video. Like we got Nebula. I like the night drive one. I took it from, uh, you can go to Reddit. You can get all these, yeah. There's a million of us. Ah, uh, here's Stevie <laughs> Shrooms. Skynet, that one's for you, buddy. The Matrix. But you just put it here, and then you can have static backgrounds. I used to do Prometheus and Bob. We got the EDC round table. Be up. Uh, there's all kinds. Here's our mental health Monday one. But yeah, you just get a moving 
picture like I don't know if it's a GIF or like an MPEG or what, but you just find it, go to add background, and then same with music. The uh, video background might be limited to the premium stream yard. Yeah. Um, I was, I was going to mention that, and also I have a different technique to get the video. If you type royalty free, like, motion art or whatever on youtube you they sometimes have a link to download it or you can use like a youtube video downloader and snag it it's um, <laughs> i show how to upload a, a video here then there's 45 comments already you guys gotta slow it down just kidding what up working at balance Ooh, Blaze uh, Burger. what's going on underutilized sack models Oh, hey, Blaze. Long time no see, dude. Maybe Yo. Post Malone will show up. I started, uh, since I'm doing the Post Malone thing anyway, I started uh, speaking of shilling, tagging some of the people I like in it. Today was Stevie. I saw that. I appreciate it. Uh, a heads up for tomorrow. Tomorrow's going to be Lynch, because why not? Uh, but yeah, I figured maybe... If he ever sees it, which he won't, you know, one of the one of the things he sees will be one of these people all tagged up in there. I think that'd be yeah. cool. John Ray, how you doing, El Cap? El Cap. Yeah, get streamer. They're free, or you get the premium. Like, yeah, I don't think you can do all that when you just go live on YouTube. I don't think YouTube Creator Studio. I've never done it. But I don't think you have all those options. No. Oh. Cheeto Lamafo. <gasps> Cheeto! Me with knives. How you guys doing? All you guys who are channel members, I appreciate all you guys. You guys are awesome. There might be a night said, you know what? You should have saw us when we just got it. Took us some figuring out, and then they keep changing it. Great shooter! Ew. GIF is peanut butter. Uh, the guy who invented it said it's pronounced GIF, not GIF. No, no he didn't. Yeah, he, he did. GIF. No. He didn't. It's GIF. I wasn't going to bother correcting. I didn't want to get into this it's argument. It's peanut butter. It's GIF. He's called Keister Tendigan. Yeah. No discount on StreamYard. <laughs> Mersa, how you doing? What's up? Randy, what's up, buddy? Hello, Randy. Gary. Hello, Gary. Speaking of Gary... Yo, Yo. Oh yeah, I was, I was getting that. Hang on, I was. I mean, I have to stop now. Here we go. Here we go. If you guys remember, some of you might remember. Boom. Suck it, Gary. <laughs> Look at that. That's awesome. Perfection. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know how many he has in stock. Like I said, this is a show part, but Forrest is our is our boy. So, look at that. Look at that. <laughs> <laughs> but get your second Gary Hank. That thing is awesome. Heck yeah. Um, is is there any way they might be able to save just a little bit of money when they go to EDC Roundtable? Is it a Stevie oh. Ten? There's yeah, definitely a, a mango tan. You had the perfect you tan. In. Mango tan. Like you have, a, you have a variety of codes. You could use mango tan, Stevie tan. I don't say mine because I forgot what it was. Maddie tan with a Y? Yeah, Maddie tan. <laughs> you can get 10% off. Holy, Holy Marty Holy tan. Molly, look at this. Troy the yeah. Troy the Mafo. <laughs> I was waiting for you to see that. Uh, we got and we got Cheeto the I love it. Troy I love it. I wonder if he's Polish. Does anyone want to buy a hundred dollar mystery knife? It's a new thing, like a mystery box, but way cooler, but also the same. Ooh, dang! 
this something you're doing? If I had a hundred bucks, I'd do it. I'm almost Even like, hello. I highlighted you. I forgot to say hi, but hello, yeah. Urban and Jeffrey. How you guys doing? Jeffrey. 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 Mrs. Urban. That means Urban's got to be on his best behavior. Uh oh, Mrs. Urban, what's up? See you you guys want you guys want to know what Urban hears when uh, Mrs. Urban's yelling at him? Hmm. <laughs> All he hears, followed by a. <laughs> <laughs> and that's exactly what Urban told us on more than one occasion. Yeah, I'm. I'm. Don't don't shoot the messenger. <laughs> you know what? I I never had allergies growing up myself. But then me and Katie moved to Colorado for two years, and when I came back to Arizona, allergies. I yeah. My ID. <laughs> it's hard to find good help these days. I get it. <laughs> Heck yeah, we like to have fun over here. What's cooking, Maybe. everybody? Maybe a little. Took a nap too. Yeah, I was sitting here. Oh. Yeah, dude. I never had allergies before I moved to North Central California, and with the, all of the farming and stuff up here, I developed allergies. Not fun. Um, StreamYard you can use on your phone, but you have to go through a browser. It doesn't have an app. Yeah. It's hard on the phone because you can't see comments. Don't do it on a phone. He said hard on. Hard on. You want to take a nap? I'm taking a nap. Okay, take a nap right there. Then. <laughs> it wasn't the. Uh, it wasn't a knife. It was a Hank. I think. I think Gary probably got it. or He's getting it. I can. Yeah, Gary threw a fit about it. You. You made a Hank about your knife. Take it however you want. Jason, how you doing? And Bobo Schnoggins. Jason Rogers. Sorry I'm late. I never apologize. Post Malone called me, asked if I knew someone who made the knife called the Phoenix. Told them no idea. But also, uh, it's kind of unexcusable, Bobo. Yeah. What's the not, You know, not <laughs> let that happen again. Todd Carr, how you doing, buddy? Hey, TC. I didn't do the go. There probably is a lefty 10. There's a lefty 10 for everything. Yeah, but that douche can promote his own stuff on his own time. <laughs> Let's see. Let's see. <laughs> Troy, I love that you changed your name everywhere. That's incredible. Oh, Double D, you want me to share that? Troy always understands the assignment. Yeah. You're bringing her stuff in good. Oh. It has books. It, it has, has books? You want to say hi to everyone? I got a TV. I got a book. You got a what? It has, it has buttons. He has a bear. Nice. Oh, whoa. He carries books, but I think the bear will actually like read the books to him. You Guys, push one of the numbers corresponding with the, the book. The big called me. The big called me. Yeah. Really? He's Maddie. T okay, so it is Maddie. T is he? Uh, yours got lost, Gary. Is he? Easter toast was a code on Blue River. That was the only place. On oh, Blue River. I forgot Blue Creek. Sorry, Blue Creek. Blue Creek vibes. Yeah. Terry, how you doing? What yeah, up, Terry? He just freaking hurts. He just, uh... 
<laughs> I read that and it totally went over my head until you said it out loud. Because I saw the Z, but yeah, I had that rabbit car as well. Freaking hurts. I've never heard this one. And it might be up there with the uh, who's sticking outside the box now. <laughs> I gotta catch up. You guys are a bunch of chatty Cathy's today. Yeah, jeez. Family reunion, all the mofos running around. I was always having the mofos involved. I, I think I mentioned it. Thank you. Uh, I started to watch a little bit of the last said faction on our TV uh, out in the living room, and I thought that Zoe had already gotten up from dinner and went to her room. I didn't realize she was still sitting behind me. But <laughs> so, I just hear you're stupid. <laughs> I saw that, Paul. I got the preview on, huh? That's awesome. Okay. Congrats on your first arcane. Preview is a big fine, fine, fine specimen of a knight. Where is. Oh, okay. okay. Wayne just sent me this. I don't know all the exact details because like, I, I haven't had a chance to listen to it. But Double D, for those of you who don't know, I say it as often as I can, but he helps families like whose kids are in the hospital. Yeah. And he's the CEO. I didn't know he was the CEO. I thought Dude. he was the but uh, we're dealing with the head honcho. But he pays for families to come stay like where the child is at the hospital and free housing and food and travel everything and I guess he was on a uh, TV show I don't know if I'm allowed to have the music but there he is, there's our boy Double D right there heck yeah, that's awesome uh, mm -hmm. it looks like they did a 5k to benefit uh, local Ronald McDonald house and that's what Double D runs nice Dwayne Dickens he shares all the fun he had this Saturday as the fourth annual Shamrock Shuffle comes to King's Common in downtown Johnson City. And also, awesome. links, you can watch this video, but uh, Double D, he, he has a, I have a soft spot for him and what he does. I, I work with kids, and he, he's helped people in this community. Yes, he has. Uh, he, he is an awesome, awesome dude. So, I'll what this was video. it? Was it Ant? Yeah, I don't want to say who, but since it's oh, yeah, Bearded yeah, yeah, yeah. Ant. No, it's okay. Bearded Ant. Uh, you know, his son had the cancer. And so they, we got them paired together. And Double D took care of all the expenses for the kid to go to the hospital. That's awesome, man. Double um, D is a fantastic dude. Heck yeah. I know him. I'm gonna put the link down, uh, but you can you can watch that and learn about Double D and learn why I like him so much. Heck yeah! Shout out to Double D. Um, okay. That's what I was gonna ask. Also, real quick, uh, Paul, the Prefion is absolutely a knife that benefits from skiffs. It's already good, but uh, I decided to pop some in here and. Uh, yeah, Pretheon is it absolutely skips uh made it great. Heck yeah. <laughs> okay, Gary Gary's bringing up a valid question in the Discord. I usually just schedule my lives like I get home, I fire it up and then we start it. Do do you guys want me to start scheduling it like way ahead of time? Even though it's always four o'clock on Wednesday for me. It's no sweat off my side. I mean I did ask for suggestions and if that I mean that sounds like a good suggestion. I, I know other people schedule lives like a week out. I just do it right before I usually do it the morning of. Yeah. I mean do you guys like them when they're scheduled out? Well I I mean there's always gonna be the couple of regulars that uh like I think, who was it earlier? I think Drizzy asked, hey, "Is Maddie not live today?" Because you hadn't actually scheduled it yet. That's true. So I can tell you, from like looking at the numbers, 
it does help engagement like if you can schedule it like the morning of uh, you know uh but it's you know if you're looking just to maintain like the regulars then that that then it doesn't really matter you know well not tonight uh knife said yeah absolutely we'd have people on and you don't have to wear pants this is a this this is a safe pants free zone yeah mm -hmm. I mean, not actually, right now. Well, I was gonna say today I'm actually wearing pants, so it's it's oh. a special occasion. Never mind. Oh, I am <laughs> so far behind. Okay, let me catch up. I'm reading all the comments. I'm not gonna say them out loud, but I'm reading them. Did you go to school with the Eric Rogers? I read that one out loud though. <laughs> no, I know a Jason Rogers. I know two Jason Rogers, actually. That's why I said Jason's name. Too late, Double D. Everyone needs to know what you do. Is he got a bear to read stories to him? Is he is amazing. Yes, he is. I just can't read, man. This one can. <laughs> oh, yeah. You know what? We have all these songs, but for some reason, in StreamYard, this particular one is the only one that doesn't just stop at some point. Yeah. All the rest will stop, and then it's like we don't realize it until we get awkward silences. But this one keeps going. The party never ends. Yeah, I don't know. This one is comforting to me. Also. I like it. Mm -hmm. But now, but we've been doing background music for so long, when it's not on, I'm like, uh, mm -hmm. uh, this is way too quiet. Yeah, yeah. It's kind of creepy quiet. What are the BCK Macabre stickers? We can, maybe we can help you get some. But Knight said, yeah, you can come on. We have all kinds of people come on. Hey, D, how you doing? Hey, D. Someone okay. put that guy in timeout. Poor some dog. How embarrassing would that be? As Scott pushed <laughs> horse dolls to the side. <laughs> oh, that's, that's good. Eli, let the dog in. Oh, there's my LinkedIn. I'm catching up. Um, Ooh, I was going to say, uh, Gary made a comment about uh, the chat. So just so you guys know, one of the things that happens when you do post the chat or the the your video super early the chat the chat will start to disappear mm. after so many hours says, hey stop screaming stop screaming sooner the better otherwise i'll be forgetting i'm here out of the way jd schedules a month out it's some assist with my balls, maybe. <laughs> Morning or day of or day before is fine. Okay. Let's see, I don't think about daylight sometimes, but also, uh, if you guys are on Instagram, you could also just follow my uh, uh, my knife uh, journey. Yes. Knife tube Crispy. schedule. Download the, the knife tube knife tube schedule. You can start picking and choosing from all your favorite people. And you can get a reminder on your uh download it to your Google Calendar. There you Ned go. Harrison. Hi. Ned Harrison. She gave you French fries? Yeah. Oh, well, she brought you guys McDonald's. I mean, I think that's how, because I constantly get reminders from people uh, asking me if I'm going live on my uh, on the weekends when I'm supposed to be live, because I forget. And uh, I know a couple people said there it was their reminder that went off. Mm -hmm. It reminds me. Yeah, you got your package today. I was wondering, they, they, they should slow. I sent them out last week. I'm wearing pants. This is, oh, pants optional always on our lives. 
I mean, that that's just good life advice, too, to be honest. It, it is. is. It is. Buck Rogers. Do you guys Everybody. remember the Dodgers? The, what is it, 24th and a half century? Huh? If, you don't, if you're not wearing yeah. pants, where do you put all those knives? Oh, I'm sure the chat can Use tell you. your imagination, Kathleen. <laughs> yeah, I'll tell you where those knives go. In, in a pouch next to us. <laughs> <laughs> Very pants optional. Okay, so we do have some new people. Yeah. Uh, my spiel again. So you have all these channels and they do lives. And some people focus on knife chat. And some people focus on, you know, flashlights or whatever. And it's fine. That's what they do. No, me no, 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 it's not me. fine. Flashlights me, are not fine. So. Boring <laughs> we, we like ours to be like, uh, you know, you go to a place and hang out. You just kick back and chat. We'll talk about knives. But we talk about other stuff, everything. It's just a, it's a hangout. Every every time Lefty okay. starts talking about knives, this is what I hear. I, every time. I love it. Every time. <laughs> And I love flashlights, don't get me wrong, but listening to him talk a lot of her. I mean, oh, yeah. flashlights or flashlights? Yeah. Like, Somebody clip that and send it to him. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so, I mean, we'll talk about knives. And, like, we've had Donnie on, and he's talked about how he makes knives, and we do that. But we also sometimes just chill. Well, most of the time, we just chill. I yell at the kids hangout. a lot. But it's just a, yeah, it's a midweek hangout. Natural conversation. End of week hangout. But just yeah, a day. Trying to make it a more natural hangout than anything. Yeah. But then, you know, you have live streams that I think definitely teeter on not just being knife content, but still are a little bit more structured, like the way I think like Sharif does it and work knife balance and even Shane. You know, Shane always has, like, a topic to talk about, you know, and it's not always knife-related. Okay, I'll see if I still have mine, and if I do, I can send you them. I'll have to see them. But let me, let me check. Give me, like, four months. I'll check. <laughs> Damn, 50 new comments? I know, as soon as you, we, we start talking today, and then, like, you look up, and it's like, boom! PNW! Oh, there, this right here is, uh, if you don't yeah. know, bookmark it. Scott N, he made his own calendar with all the live channels and, like, some people when they post a video or mostly lives. And then he made it for everybody now. And, and that's where you can uh, download it to your Google Calendar and, yeah. and get reminders that way. Yeah. But with how many things are on there, I wouldn't do that. Well, no, you can pick and choose. You don't have to oh, download the entire... Yeah, you can pick and choose. Oh, okay, I was, was going to say, there's a lot now. Yeah, your phone would be going off nonstop. But Scott, <laughs> Scott made this on his own. It's his own thing, and yeah. he decided to share it. And it's really cool. And Scott keeps it updated all the time. So definitely bookmark it. And uh, it, it's really cool. I think it's awesome with Scott to do that. Yeah, it's it's so impressive. It's oh, so just three amigos. <laughs> Heart sink down. Dang. That was great life advice until it isn't. <laughs> You're in a situation where it's not pants optional. Do you even want to be in that situation? Do you need exactly. to be there? Is that how you want to live your life? You have to wear pants. Right? Awesome. I forgot to say hi. Samurai Bird. How you doing, buddy? Samurai Bird. Oh. Yeah. You got your... that, that's why I was doing this earlier. That was oh, for okay. Ed Harrison. The Dodgers in the 24th and a half centuries. That was Daffy Duck at his peak with Marvin the Martian and, oh. Uh, Oh, Marvin the Martian 
one of the most elite characters in the yeah. Looney Tunes universe. That was my mom's favorite, like Looney Tunes character when I was growing up. So it became mine as a kid. Like yeah. I like him more than Bugs Bunny, but I loved Daffy versus him. Those are some of my favorite cartoons. Dude, Daffy and Bugs when they went to uh, Alibaba and the Forty Thieves. One of my favorite of all time. Brian also, Kerr, hello. Uh, the other night when, when I said I'm not going to reveal my uh, deepest fear because uh, I'm smarter than that. <laughs> Everybody guessed ducks. Like, I wasn't scared of ducks before, <laughs> but those images were freaking terrifying. <laughs> that was Some of those were. AI can get creepy. AI can get very creepy very quickly. Yeah, that one's like a two hour <laughs> session of. <laughs> there you go, Scott. In. What's I up? Love it. Olight is the only flashlight. Yeah. <laughs> you know, I have Olight. Oh, well, that's high praise. But my favorite flashlight's this cheap $20 one. Some no name Suni Tech. But I, this right here, this is my favorite. When I, when I go out to the desert, this thing lights it up like daylight. As an EDC light, this Dapper Ion is going on two plus years, man. In, in yeah, my pocket in the, every day. The dapper's a good one. Where's my pouches? They're gone. They're gone forever. I have one. And, and your biggest joy is juggling these nuts, Keith. <laughs> Juggle away, mofo. Juggle away. <laughs> Keith, I want to see that big chopper uh, that you uh, you made that the sexual. cut out. <laughs> oh, the cardboard Job. one yeah that had a nice sax blade or cx however you want to say it it had a real n nice sex blade <laughs> 130 pounds of beef curly hair gold teeth you need practice i'm leaving used rubbers on the mattress <laughs> name this stevie this is like a song Real 210 and Paul, how you guys doing? I Where? am not able to read quick enough. Oh, here, I'll leave it up for you. Sorry, there you go. 130 hair and gold teeth, sausage party. Of what there is the you practice. I'm leaving used rubbers on the mattress. I'll put the duck in the Discord. I can't, uh, it's I'm drawing a blank right now. Pizza's got a Koenig Arius on the way. For the ladies. It'll come to me. As you start hearing Stevie's keyboard start clacking. But I'm not gonna. I'm trying to uh, make it hang out, huh? Is that why pants are optional? Uh, yeah. <laughs> of course. We like the Winnie the Pooh style. We yeah. usually end up talking about Shane Chain's nipples. Oh, God. Blame Shane Chain. Blame it on Shane's nibs. <laughs> Let's see. Everyone's saying hi to everyone. Milton, how you doing, buddy? Hello, Yo. Bob. There he is in one hand, ramen in the other. That sounds oh. pretty good. I know. Chips and salsa sound good. I had Chipotle for lunch, so it's kind of fitting. <laughs> Two years with no pants. Nice. Heck yeah. That's the way. Ooh, the Martian on the Flintstones. What was his name? This is this the G, like Kazoo or something? Kazoo? Kazoo? I think it was the Great Kazoo. Great, yeah. The Great, yeah. Man was never meant to wear pants. We were meant to go pantsless all the time. Let them wings dangle. Pippi lip here. He would not fly these days. I, was, I wasn't scared of clowns until I learned other people thought they were scary. Oh. Don't tell them that, Kathleen. 
Don't tell them that. A zoo. Okay. Ockhorn Leghorn was a G. Yeah. I say. I say. <laughs> <laughs> this is Stevie's biggest fear. Stay out of the ice caves. <laughs> Piss off, Marsh here. <laughs> Find these nuts on your chin. <laughs> I just saw one. There's a washing machine salesman for a little company called the Wishy Washy Washing Machine Company for Walla Walla oh, Washing. Walla. <laughs> <laughs> you know, and he's a corkscrew. Duck wiener joke. <laughs> Let's see. Joe Kasparik, how you doing? Phoenix, you I have do. a little square one. I do have a Phoenix. Yeah, same. I have one more for like a truck light. Angelo. Oh man, those idiot clowns. Oh. Mr. Kyle. Hey, Kyle. Palmer, how you doing? I'm with you, Palmer. Hello. Don't literally turn around, Palmer. He's with you. Forest. <laughs> Forest. What's up, dude? What's up? The new Hanks look awesome. Sucky guy. <laughs> Buenos dias, bromosexuals. Hello, hey. Jim. Hey. Did I know him? What up, Frankie? Great Gazoo. Is it Gazoo? It was Gazoo or Kazoo? What are I think it was Gazoo, though. And I just thought it was Kazoo. The G. What the heck? I don't know. The G was silent. Great zoo. <laughs> Got some epic music. That's what we got right now. Or, I mean, if Maddie's pronouncing that would be the great Jizu. Smacking <laughs> from CB4. Subbox 4? Uh, oh. <laughs> CB4. That, I haven't seen that in so long. That right? Chris Rock, right? Yeah, right. Chris Rock and... Um, and I'm trying to pull That was a deep thing. Awesome. <coughs> you know what? If you have the tinnitus, you don't need an Aries. <laughs> hey, Metal, how you doing? What up? Kazoo. Okay. Oh, no. Kazoo. Now we're torn. We are torn. Half the chat says Gazoo. Half the Ooh. chat says Kazoo. Todd says Gazoo. Fight, fight, fight. fight. I was going to side with Terry, but then the great Todd Carr chimed in. And we need all the K's on one side, all the G's on the other. Let's G's see up, K's down. G's up, K's down. <laughs> uh, I think um, Lil Wayne said it best real G's moving silent like lasagna. Ian is sending me a mystery oh. box. I'm sending him $100 when I receive it. <laughs> He's going to open it. Ah, that ain't worth 100 <laughs> Steven, how you doing, buddy? What's up? Everything I know about opera, bugs taught me. Yeah. <laughs> Mark Herrera, how you doing? Palmer, you're not old enough to time in on this conversation. Tomorrow or Friday. It will. It's going to Up Javon next. next. Month. <laughs> it's going to Javon next. <laughs> it can't be in the clown stuff and the nice stuff. It's either or. Both That's <laughs> creepy. <laughs> they made oh. a clone. Remet is making clones? Why? Why would you order that? If they're yeah. stealing designs, they're dead to me now. Why would you order that? Why? Is it like a? So is it like a real? Out. I oh. I think that's like this. No offense, dude. I mean, I'm not coming at you, but I just hate that. I just want to check it out to see if it's any good. <laughs> but but hold on, is it really like a clone or is it? I mean, the, the the blade shape is it's. Oh yeah, I see it. Now. It's for sure an F five point five. Yeah. No yeah. We are still torn though. Gazoo, gazoo, gazoo. Ooh, is this a Mandela effect thing? It might be because we are we are 
half torn. Yeah. Tactical Terror says Bazoo. Google says Bazoo. Palmer's coming in. Oh, he made it up. Okay, never mind. Yeah, but you're like seven, Palmer. So. Zero bites. Hello. What's up, zero? Ian, I was joking. I know you wouldn't send Grant. <laughs> Ian's like, fuck. You son of a. I thought we were friends. You don't know. <laughs> I was just kidding, Ian. You know, you know what Ian thought when he heard you say that? You son of a bitch. <laughs> e horse. I have to look this up. Dude, I can I just take a two second comment on like the whole remet thing? Uh if you guys don't mind. They just are going to release a knife called the Kingfisher that's actually really cool. You can take out the backspacer and use it as like a disassembly tool. If they're doing stuff like that, why are they copying the yeah, bottom? Right? Like if you have that capability, it's such a waste of your reputation. Go get the real five point five. Son of a bitch. Damn straight. <laughs> <laughs> I remember they hit me up a long time ago, and I told them hit the highway. Okay, like, yeah, uh, they they when they hit me up, I replied back, "No thanks." Yeah. Mm. That was that. I'm if I was an illegal poacher. Not once did I see a permit. Ooh. <laughs> True. Brian. Brian. Hey, you, buddy. <clears throat> BBC. It's the F5.5.5. <laughs> Nerdy Nas will tell you it's Kazoo. <laughs> I watched him over the yesterday, and he was on that Kazoo nonstop. Dang. He, I, if I were him, I'd find a different uh, different gimmick, because uh, he, he was turning red. <clears throat> Zone of other Chinese products doesn't bother me. Not that I buy them. I I still don't like clones at all. Let's see. Mancala affect the game? <laughs> yeah, it's box. It's box though. Vox finally started, you know, he, he was doing customs for uh, that's what the F5.5 is based off of, is the yeah. F5. And he got so much shit about, you know, his knives cost, you know, hundreds and hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of dollars. And he's like, okay, you know, I'll start licensing more stuff out. So, does it really? I didn't know that. Yeah, I didn't know that either. I now have a fifty dollar mystery box. You guys should take a it on his on his box. Get in Ian's box. Come on. I was just about to say, hop on Ian's box. Sniff it. Sniff Ian's box. You definitely want to be in his box. Admiring his collection. His family indulges him because they care. They do. Brian's family seems awesome. Yeah. And I would never make them mad because his two sons are giants. <laughs> yeah, the kazoo is going like crazy. Yeah, it does it does get a lot, but it's neat. I mean the right. channel's grown though, so he needs a new thing because uh I'll be right back. He looked like he was dying. <laughs> Could be some cool stuff in there. Out of Blade Walker. Blade Walker, how you doing? What's going on? I want a two hundred dollar mystery box for fifty bucks. <laughs> oh, Blade Walker says he'll do the fifty box. Ian. Oh, done. Did anyone get it? Yep. Crispy critter. Well, looks like uh, Blade Walker was the first to say he'll do fifty. Oh wait, work knife though said can I get full? Don't be greedy. 
<laughs> one moon is back. Oh, you missed everything. Yeah, one box only. Hazel. Very close. Actually, every night I'm getting ready for work. Miss B.E. BBC's collection rivals mine. What? She has a collection too? Hmm. Thanks, so. the music down. There we go. I'll lay away your box, kind of like a marriage. You know, it's my cover shipping up here. Oh. Well, we were talking about it a bunch. Let's talk about it some more. Huh. Who got your kaimanos? This is the week of the kaimano. Oh, man. Really? You're going to put me on the spot? I am. Who got your kaimanos? Man. You know what? Let's mix it up then. For those of you who got a kaimano, is is there anything you would change? The answer is no. <laughs> for me, for me, it's a no. I, I like how it is. Because the problems with the prototype that I didn't like, you did fix. Yeah. But let's just, I like hearing the other side. Is there anything you would change? Get ready for some screenshots. Hans is a renowned marriage counselor. <laughs> that does not make it, that doesn't make it not the perfect knife. It just means you need smaller hands or an XL version. Yeah, you need an XL version. Oh, Paul yeah, he would. I saw that. Oh, Paul would said he would do a flipper delete. So there may be some blems that I do as special editions that have a flipper delete. Let's see. How would it? It would look good without the flipper. Yeah. But the flipper, like, flipper action is nice on this one. I like having a good flipper. I, it gives you that good choil. I, I have plenty, plenty of knives that are flipperless that I don't mind, but yeah. I like having a flipper to have. That's what yeah. it's about, Knife's Edge. That right there. That's why we do our lives. We'll talk about knives, but we'll also do other stuff. But yeah, it's a happy place. I like that. This are is you what here? I actually like. asked for that, and it was not an option for me, actually. Which one? Uh, he asked for a version with a stonewashed blade, and at the time it was uh, not an option. Scott's saying a deeper carry clip. Okay. Hmm. You know what? I saw on the Kaiser, the new Militaw, they have like a polished DLC. Yeah, they just started doing DLC recently. That would look amazing. It's polished, though. Yeah. Amazing on this. Hey, uh, is the scale notched to fit the pocket clip? No. No? No, so that pocket clip is truly reversible. I wonder if Lynch, any of Lynch's patterns would fit in. I can get the dimensions and uh, see if Lynch has something in their their catalog that would fit it. Yeah, this blade wants to be flipped. Oh, it got two <laughs> kimonos. The 37 is better action. Knife Dot, how you doing, buddy? Yeah, I uh, QC'd the crap out of number 37 for Ed Harrison. Made sure that one was bang on. So, if you notice, Sharif, it seems like the only thing people would change is delete the flipper. Which... Yeah. People are going to say that for every single night. Fair. You can first flick it. And our sheer one is talking about an all black Kaimano. Dude, our sheer, I looked into that. It would be expensive. Um, every place that I've talked to has quoted me over $115 to full DLC out the scales, the pocket clip, and the blade. Oh, wow. Yeah. And I don't think anybody wants to spend, you know, $400 on, uh, on a Kaimano, if I'm honest. You know? 
I definitely don't. Gons, no. Uh, the purples go up to 200. The uh, micartas only go up to 100. Just tap it in. Just tap it in. Dwayne Letterman, how you doing, buddy? It's got in. He's not the only one, actually. Oh, yeah. Let me just think of that. Yeah. Uh, Crispy Critter has two, I believe. Yeah. And a couple of other people are getting two. So. I was way behind on the stream. Uh, we asked you for your social address. Uh... You know, everything. Bank yeah. account number. You were ignoring us, so now we don't really want it. Thanks for nothing, I guess. Interesting. No, Paul, I haven't. I, th I, I would assume that uh, the reason why Spiderco is moving that way is because DLC has to be applied with uh, heat, and uh, that can affect the heat tree and reduce the HRC. Um, Troy, uh, 27. Arshir, I definitely do. So, whenever you're ready, they are ready and waiting for you. Me and B Shady, uh, we're number neighbors. You got 22, I have 21. Yeah. I need to find out who's going to have 20 then. See, find out who all my number neighbors are. Gary, not as many people uh, bought the micarta as they did the the purple haze, which is why originally I was going to do less of the purple haze. But if I did that, uh, I may not have very many left, so I reversed the numbers. I originally had micarta, but then I just switched to purple because I plan on sending mine to Bill to get a red and black one. Ooh. Is that like red and black? I like purple. Oh. So I can have both. Switch it. But a let red me, and black one would be neat. Let me check, Stephen. Hold on one sec. Who is number 33 gone? Yeah, hashtag squad. Number squad. If you got number 20 in the purple, let me know. Can you unhide Angelo? Uh-oh. 20 is gone? Hang on, uh, I think 33 in the micarta is floating around here somewhere. Hang on, Angelo. Angelo, Angelo. I'm going to go to live chat. All right, Angelo. When did he get hidden? Ah, uh, that one only lets me scroll up so far. Angelo, type something. Let me see if it pops up. But I'll scroll up on here. Let me see. Hey. Let's Angelo. see. Angelo. I don't see him on here either. He did get hidden, huh? Angelo. Uh, Steven, work knife. Um, okay, yeah, 33 is gone. Uh, actually, in both, I don't see Hashtag 33 on any of them. Let me just double check. I have number one. That's 26 for my birthday. And, yeah, I think 33 is gone in both. I... Yeah, yeah. I think 33 is gone in both. Sorry to say. Hello. Let's see. Angelo was timed out by Todd Carr. The stupid heart thing's in the way. That's not letting me do anything. Angelo, I will find a way to hide you. <laughs> Offspring squatters. <laughs> Angelo, Angelo, here we go. I can't do it from StreamYard because it says just put him in timeout. Let me check, Arshir. Let me see if I can go back in time. Angelo, Angelo. 
we will save the day. Hey, sure, keep him entertained for a second. I don't like awkward sounds. I have to save Angelo. I'm looking. Ah. Hang on, Angelo. Let me go into studio. Let me see if you're there. Let's maybe, see. Maybe Setting? Available. It's, it, I think 88 may be available. It's in a box where the numbers aren't pointing up. So uh, I'll have to dig for... 88 right now. Gwen Stefani. There's Angelo. Angelo, say something. Cherry picking EDC was hidden this whole time? Ah, uh, I see Colton. Rick Hinderer. He's, uh, yep, he's, he's timed out. There we go. That's good. What up, Captain Brad? A lot of these names, I remember them. And then Gwen Stefani. <laughs> Okay, Angelo, say something. Speak to me, Angelo. Come on. Don't you die on me. <laughs> Hopefully he didn't, like, leave. Let's see. He's okay. unhidden, though. I took him out of the hidden box. He's out of the penalty box. I gotta make sure. Angelo, say something. Oh, I see Papa Rhino. Poopykins. Papa, Papa Rhino. Big Ross. I've been spending these last couple minutes trying to unhide Angelo. Oh, Bo, she had him. He'll come back. He'll come back. There we go. Yeah, if you guys accidentally hide someone, let me know. We can fix it. Okay, Plum died. Block Gwen Stefani. Yeah, she was in there. She was in that list. Yeah, Gwen Stefani. Alright, where were we? Angelo show up. Yeah, the Kamano. This thing's sweet. So Sharif, are you frozen? No, you no frozen? sorry, I was just um uh, whatchamacallit, uh, uh, replying to, uh, DMs about orders. Oh. Uh, just that people are excited, you know, to get theirs, and they just want to have an idea where they're at in the queue, so I try to let them know, just to say, like, okay, yeah, like, I'm shipping out an average of Somewhere between 10 and 20 every couple of days. So uh, I try to let people know, like, hey, you're number 10 for the next batch or number five, you know? So okay. that's cool. Yeah. I, you know, it helps to, to manage expectations, you know, and kind of give people assurances that things are going out, you know? So. Forrest, I love the font he used for this one. It's perfect, dude. He chose, yeah, he chose a perfect font for this. <laughs> I love it. I love it. Thank you, Mr. Shear. Thank you very much, dude. Appreciate you. <laughs> oh, man. I know, I remember even more than the sex bots, I kind of miss those very violent bots that showed up that one day. <laughs> I don't know if you were here for that, Jury, but we had these bots one day come in and they were like, uh, they had to have been AI or something, but they were like, we're going to burn all the children in the street and then vote somebody as president. Oh, really? Yeah. But it was like in Manila or something. <laughs> They were, Dude. they were random and violent. I remember the sex bots, but I don't, I do not recognize, I never saw the, the 
Gons remembers. Violent ones. Oh, they were violent. Gons remembers, yeah. Stab your eyes out. Man, I wish I... It was, yeah, you were, it was Marcos. That's right. It was. It was like burn the children's bodies in the street or something. Oh, dang. And then, yeah, vote for president. Oh, Marcos. oh you had screen I, cuts? I couldn't <laughs> find a lynch uh that i wanted to pull off but this is a trm adam okay. now sticks out too far in my opinion on the this would be ultra deep carry though yeah and like in the hardware isn't matching up you'd have to use some different uh shorter screws yeah but Maybe uh, there was, would be some in the parts kit that could work. That's what I was going to... Uh, I don't want to bust everything out, but I think that yeah. that's only a possibility. I got one other thing I'm going to try. Thick. There you go, Scott. If yes, you want a, an ultra-deep carry. The evil Justin Bieber bot. Yeah, see, it's starting to come back now. Eat the children. They wanted to. I remember it was like in Manila. Burn the. They were. We had sex spots for a long time, and all of a sudden those violent ones came in for a day. That's they said, kinda awesome. They said some stuff though. I'm hoping Troy can find screenshots if he still has them. But that was like a year, maybe. That was a long time ago. Maybe two years ago. So if he doesn't have them, that's fine because I can go back in the lives and find it. But that was uh, that was nuts, dude. Let's put a cat up there. I got them in the basement. <laughs> so did anyone get anything new since uh, I guess yesterday that's when I was on with Shreep yesterday? Anyone get anything new? I did. Ooh, what'd you get? So, uh, Dan Matsuda is like a super well known maker of like bags and gear and stuff like that. And I finally pulled a trigger on something that I could afford from him. And Patina will really appreciate this. I, I waited until Patina was here to talk about this, but Patina Turner, I got Patina my Beckham. first. Dan Matsuda pouch. Oh, it's a pouch. And this thing is actually really sweet. Like, that's a, a thing for patches. You get, like, tons of internal storage. Came with a notebook and a little Sharpie, which is actually pretty dope. And this is really crazy. There's, like, a spine Sharp little, bag. like, storage area which i'd never seen before so nice yeah just wanted to see like what is kind of considered the one of the the top guys in the field what he made you know and definitely feel like i got something worthwhile you know for the money which is kind of rare in the space you know so, oh, God. Kind of the Praytheon and the Gunslinger. Great. God's got the Wee Banter. 20 CV. Oh, Jeffrey I got fine. Skills for the Manix. Since no one's told me one way or another on this thing, I'm going to I'm gonna put some skills on this. Oh, yeah, Kyle. I got fine. <laughs> Aries. Uh, Lancelot Leather can make you an awesome roll. Yeah. Or, or, if she opens her books again, can't find Leatherworks. Iggy! Shout out yeah. to Iggy. She made me this book. But look at Papa Rhino's uh, chef knife roll that Iggy made. Yeah. Forrest is my dude, and Iggy is my dudette. But yeah, check check out those two people. <laughs> Forrest. 
Can you put your weed in it? <laughs> I knew up. you'd appreciate it, Patina. Now we're All the these other, you know, Philistines wouldn't get it, but... <laughs> uh, this is print, from what I could... I... Okay, it's definitely got... not... Well, I don't... No, it's print. It's print on the pouch. Steve's been working. Okay, let's look at that. You got a lynch clip on it. Doesn't quite match up on the McNeese. Okay. That's better, though. I can, uh, like I said, I can get the measurements and we can kind of talk to Lynch if you do oh. different. Lynch uh, has sure something. Uh, if, uh, I was going to say, uh, if, if you were going to ask him about making a clip. Oh, no, no, no. It, it would, I would just ask him if he had something that already fit that spacing. Yeah. Gotcha. No, it, it wouldn't make sense for him to do something where there's only 300 of them on the market. Like, Well, and, and also, outside of a one-off that he did with the F5.5, yeah. a Casey actually won't OEM for a, a non-US knife. Yeah, yeah, I get that. No, it would it would be something that already exists. Yeah. You know, that's all that would make sense, honestly. Irvin, how's the uh, titanium Moyaro? I never even tried the first one, but the titanium one. Yeah, I'm taking it now. No one has come forward, so I'm going to throw some scales on this bad boy. QSP very. A lot of people like QSP here. Got Gucci taste with a ramen budget. <laughs> Best way to live. <coughs> Mimo's got a murdered out S30V big slippy 14C today. Oh, nice. dude, is that one of the new Todd Bag uh, Fieldcraft or whatever ones? Gun near. Gun near is amazing. Okay, I got good news. Huh. The Protec clip fits the Morta or fits the Kimono. Oh, okay. The Lynch Northwest will also. Okay. So you just need to get some uh, some different um, hardware for it. Yeah. And there it'll... is. Um, where That's is... wicked. Heck yeah, dude. There you go, Scott. It's just the the Protec compatible Lynch Northwest clips, and you can get check. deep carry. About uh, to get all deep. Take me off of. <laughs> Papa Rhino is a uh, professional chef, and uh, he had this knife roll made, and it's beautiful. Let me see if I can find it. I think he put it on Instagram. It's on Instagram. Papa here? He was, yeah. Let's see. Where, where is it? Where is it? Oh, where is my toothbrush? Ooh. You could do like a blurple one. Of the Lynch Northwest clips. That bit may be nice. Hmm. It's oh, definitely yeah. somewhere. Heck yeah. Nice. Um, the TRM Adam clip will also absolutely work. And the nice thing about the TRM Adam is that it's um got an open yeah it's slotted uh, it's it's slotted in the back so you can adjust it to where it needs to be nice heck yeah dude oh yeah i did see that you put a video out 
Everyone go check out uh, Urban's video on the Titanium um, Migoron Moyaro. Moyaro. I always have trouble saying that word, Moyaro. Which spider coat? This one? The Manic is too lightweight. Yeah. Have you guys seen the new Manix 3? No. Is, is there a Manix 3? It's wicked. Cheeto. Cheeto around? If Cheeto's around, he'll post a picture of it. Oh, dang. B to C, you're halfway then? Heck yeah. 40 pounds down. Which is I'm, awesome. I'm 10 right now. 10 down. Working on it. I am stagnant because I kind of let excuses pop up. I'm not losing, but I haven't gained. I've just You're been letting work in the way. That's that's awesome, Brian. Heck yeah. Congratulations. Oh. And, and also... Doing... Oh, sorry. No, I was gonna say shout out to Doom too. Doom, freaking yeah, yeah. Doom is Doom is like two thirds of the Doom that he was, and I never even met original Doom. But Katie bought me a recliner, so they're gonna bring it in today. Nice. Oh wow! Yeah, they might have it on a file. I asked her, and she said, "I don't know." Uh, maybe I don't have a recliner. That bullshit, Katie. Yeah, you know? yeah. <laughs> see if he's telling that's BS. <laughs> Check out the Moyaro. No, that one's kind of cheap enough. I can I can just get one. But now that they have the type, I, mean, I don't know. I heard the Moyaro was really good. But it was a hype knife, so I kind of stayed away. Everyone was talking about that knife for so long. Mm-hmm. Usually when that happens, like, I steer clear for a while. And most of the time it's led me good. But one knife that was a hype knife, that was actually legit, the nine. Oh, yeah. This this one deserved all the hype it got. Seriously. Yeah, I agree. Quiet Carry does great stuff. Like... Yeah, Paul. Well, Patina kept showing his quiet carry, uh... The drift. Drift? That Bill spotted. So it made me look mm -hmm. at it. It just happened to be there last year, so... I, I like it. And I remember Stevie had the one... Oh, yeah. You were comparing it with the rock wall, and you chose the rock wall over it. Yeah, the waypoint? Yeah. The only mega one I haven't got in the Moyaro is the one I wanted. Trained around, got two others, but still no titanium. I think the titanium is uh, the brand new one. It's brand new. Ooh. It was your budget knife for the year for this year? Whoa, we're talking to work knife balance from the future. We are. <laughs> Gee. Maybe, I should, uh, maybe I, should, I should get on it. We got. How is uh, Dogecoin doing? Right? Should I buy or sell? Always Dude, sell. Good one. Nice. I just got a new recliner too. I need a new recliner to go with my new TV. LG 65 inch 4K. Nice. Where the Mafo's living it good up there. Where the Mafo is living it. Honkawaki. How high can I live? I usually do. I, I tend to stay, steer clear. But the Quiet Carry 9 so far is the only one that actually deserved it. No, you didn't. I have it in print right here. <laughs> Doesn't matter. <laughs> Siri making me look like a goon. <laughs> a future goon. Oh, the Rhino. Yes, uh, that actually already went out a long time ago, actually. It was kind of an under-the-radar one, but I'll show you who it went to. Yep. 
I'll show you who got it. Somebody <laughs> serving. Some dude got it. It had the Timascus clip on there. Uh, but yeah, some dude. Yeah, what out to some dude. Why whenever I see that that donkey face, I hear uh, Arnold Schwarzenegger. <laughs> Peek behind the curtain. My printer. Some of the kitchen. Um, before we put the printer here, we used to have a, a jellyfish tower, like with big jellyfish. It was pretty relaxing. Oh, it's That's... still there? <coughs> oh, it's like... It's like right here. I have to set it up. I'm carrying. I'm not. Hell yeah, Forrest. <laughs> Hell yeah, bro. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Scared of flavors, I guess. You got a stamp? Cool. Izzy. Izzy, look, Stevie says hi. Izzy. <laughs> How you doing, Izzy? Acknowledge the Stevie. Acknowledge me. Say say what you want. Like, uh, no, say what you want, Ceviche. All right. Hey, I got <laughs> something to tell you. Are you listening? Yeah. Are you listening? Listen real close. Are you going to take that from are you going to take that from him? That's an airy fart. That's like a low fiber. Like the poop is going to be dusty when it comes out first. <laughs> yeah. Those are the worst poops, Izzy. All right. That's it. You're dismissed. Uh, Mimo, the rhino, you might be thinking of the Edgy Blade Works logo because it's two rhinos engaging in uh, rhino activity. Mike Jernak! Yeah, some dude, uh, he got the rhino a while ago. I was so excited because uh, some dude, he doesn't have like a lot of fancy knives. He, he uses like a beaters and stuff. So it's kind of cool for him to get like the rhino was uh, kind of a pricey night. It was cool for him to get that. Heck yeah. <laughs> Party but some good. dude lives like on the ocean, so he just gets beaters because they like rust. Uh -huh. <laughs> He's pretty. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Joe. You think it was me? Yeah. Joe. Wouldn't be a surprise to him. I'm the jellyfish cat. Oh, Mike Jernak finally saw it. I did change the year badge. Nice. I, I hand drew it yesterday. Let's see. Who has the, the year badge? I'm guessing Mike Jernak. Gary has it. Troy Lamafo. Dang Ross. Ed Harrison. It used to be the golden acorn, but now it's, uh, it's a squirrel holding the golden <laughs> acorn. Brand new Americans got it. Yeah, I like I like seeing the uh, the new one. Oh, yeah, you, got it. You missed the the pizza operator member yeah. for ten months. Oh, that, I was on the YouTube page. Oh uh, yeah. Wait, should I use this one, or I think Stevie put the goat down in here too? Did you? Yeah. <laughs> What's this one? You want to take a nap? Oh. Okay, take a nap right there. See, it's not as good as a soundboard, though. Well, because it cuts the music out. Yeah. yeah. We'll figure it out, though. Oh, hold on. You weren't going to do that yet. Awkward. <laughs> oh, <my God. laughs> is, it, is it loud enough? Yeah. Stevie has the new one. I do. 19 months. I'm going to have to start doing a uh, 
a 24 month one. Yeah, see, some dude, yeah. Mine is big. Mine is big. Shout out, some dude. <laughs> some dude is one of the coolest people ever. And he just sent Forrest a picture that's awesome. Oh. Luminati, how you doing? You know, Ooh. I think uh, some dude, if I'm not mistaken, you won, I think, like one of my early, early, early on uh, giveaways. I think that's how we kind of met. Was it for the, uh, I think it was for the Kershaw Scallion, was it? Scallion. That sounds familiar. It's like the leak, yeah, but smaller. I think it was Scallion. I also have a beverage check. What are you drinking? I got Coke Zero. My, Coffee. Black. Like my soul. Like his soul. Nacho my nacho usual cheese. mug of nacho cheese. <laughs> nacho cheese. Let's see. You know, there's a member in the community. He doesn't come to my channel so much, but he has. But he's designing a knife, and he's, uh, you guys might know him, but he's an actual boat captain. And I'm curious what he comes up with. He's in the chat right now. Is, Is he it who? Captain Ricky? No, not Ricky. Oh. Captain Brad? Yeah, he said he hi did? earlier. Did he? Yes, he did. When? Oh, I must have missed it. I mean, now would be a while back, but yeah. Well, Captain Brad, hello, if you're listening. I didn't know. Ah, uh, yeah, Coke Zero. You know what? Even when I That's go actually... my diet, I still don't go to regular Coke. Um, What I will say is I agree. I like Coke Zero more than regular Coke now. But I like the Safeway Select Coke Zero version better than Coke Zero. Ooh. Good. I have Safeway Select Root Beer Zero, and that's pretty good. I'm crying like a cat. You're crying like a cat? Yeah. Why? Is that what it was? Go eat your dinner, child. You have chicken nuggets over there. Nice. Maybe Captain Brad had to step out, okay. but he was here earlier for sure. But what 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 is everyone drinking? I saw like no beverage check yet. Make some chips for two year cardboard chips. Oh, you got water, Diet Mountain Dew. There you go. I was missing these. Um, Baja Blast Zero is pretty good. Ice cold can of Coke. That's a hard thing to beat. Pizza, I agree. All the soda McDonald's is something different. I don't like the diet. Oh, that's good. But I, uh, yeah, I Gary, survived. that typically all I'm drinking is tea or water and coffee. Safeway Select is their brand of, of soda and their, their yeah. brand. Safeway or Albertsons, uh, the Select like brand. Uh, it's it's the cheapo brand. Um, they didn't have uh, Coke Zero one time, so I just bought that, and I I like it more. Mm. But I just don't drink soda pop all that often anymore. Yeah, I make a lot of tea, a lot of tea. I do, and I have a little bit of mung fruit sweetener that I toss in it, just a little bit. To take a little bit of the bitterness of the tea off. There you go. Ice water is one of my favorite drinks. That's I, I drink like three of the big 64 ounces every day. At water, I started, or at work, I started drinking water in a big old jug. I'm trying to drink way more water. Peach Pear LaCroix. Suck it, haters. That's the one where the flavor comes from a guy just yelling peach into it. Peach! <laughs> Strawberry! And then that's where you get your flavor. Enjoy the Mafo's mustache. <laughs> Chicago, how you doing? 
Where is Troy? There we go. Yeah, look at it. Even all the play logos on it. In order to find certain tree stabber, you're gonna have to look up Troy Lamafo now on Instagram. <laughs> Safeway is our grocery store. Are those not nationwide? I thought they were. I only thought that because we went to a Safeway in Atlanta. Yeah. Safeway is, I like it way better than Kroger. It's I, a little bit more expensive, but a the little quality bit, yeah. is so much better. But that's where yeah, we went grocery shopping in Atlanta with uh, Nuz. Nuz bought like every kind of uh, pastry available. And then we bought like two big ass boxes of uh, Hot Pockets. Hot Pockets, yeah. Yeah. And ate like none of them. <laughs> Until the last day, we decided to skip going out with everybody, went back to the house, and snacked like crazy on, on Hot Pockets. Those were good Grateful, times. Grateful Panic came over. He did. And he Hot Pockets with us. He did. We were like kids with matchbox cars, except knives. We had our cases <laughs> open, laying on the floor like this, legs kicking in the air. Man, it, for those of you who have not been to a Blade Show, make sure you do that. Like, Blade Show itself is fun, but go back to someone's room or B&B and hang out and talk knives and just chill. That part is so much better than the actual show. Angela was back. He really is. How to drink water if I'm out of coffee. <laughs> Why don't I lime agua fresca for me today? Ooh. Ooh, making a good agua fresca is... I, uh... You can ask Batty. Me going into, like, my whole diabetes thing, I was obsessed with agua frescas, and I was making watermelon agua frescas, like, Every, Every day, horchata and heck yeah, diet caffeine free Mountain Dew. Why caffeine? Wait. That's the that's the whole point of Mountain Dew. I was just about to say that. <laughs> I think that they should put like uh, some sort of sterile sterilization agent in Mountain Dew because anyone who drinks that shouldn't breed. <laughs> I drink Prime and it makes my heart flutter. I yeah. drink a lot of energy drinks. Or a lot less than I used to, but still a lot. But there's one called C4. And I guess it's a, like a before working out or something, but it makes my body hot and my skin itch. Yeah, yeah. But you should, uh... one, the Skittles flavor, I just drank through the pain. That Skittles <laughs> flavor was amazing. No Safeway in Minnesota or Minnesota? South Dakota? Oh. What? Oh. I don't know. By the way, Sharp Guy, you got to be careful with the primes because that's 200 milligrams of caffeine. That's like <laughs> more oh. than... It's like, what? Four cups of coffee in one drink? You, you got to be careful, for sure. Yeah, three fries closer to you than one Safeway. I go to the Safeway, 83rd Avenue Cactus, right up the road. I don't think there's any. You guys need a Safeway. Well, what about Albertsons? And then there's a third one, Bashes. That's owned by a Safeway. I don't know that one. We had some, but they closed down. Blade Walker, go to one of the Blade shows. Yeah. <laughs> you know what? Sharif went live last night and Cubo came on and yeah, he talked you about it. You talked about it. You talked about Stevie farting in his mouth. Right? Yeah, and that that's what makes me an even bigger jerk. Because <laughs> Cubo's like, yeah, he farted in my mouth. Yeah. <laughs> like he's not he's not even bad. <laughs> he's not. He's like, he got me good. <laughs> Uh, Cresc, that's what I was just about to say, though. Winco is my jam. 
We have one, but it's too far. It's on Bell Road. I go to Winco for everything I possibly can. But they do Shasta for their store. They're owned by the employees, right? Yeah, employee owned. That's cool. Okay. And they got like all the bins where you can like buy stuff in bulk. Ooh, punched rock star. I can't. I don't like any of those drinks. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I was in the Discord one day and I was like, man, my skin's itchy and I feel hot. And someone said that the C4s are pre working out. Yeah. And then I'm probably allergic to it. But man, it tastes just like liquid Skittles. <laughs> it was so good. I kept buying it anyway. I was like, I'll just deal with it. <laughs> Welcome back, Double D. You've missed nothing. Uh, we Pizza Operator, we don't have Kroger here. We have something called Fred Meyer, which is owned by Kroger. This one? No. They, they used to be like the local Pacific Northwest grocery store yeah. and got bought out. Same with Hagen. Myers is a Midwest thing, kind of like Walmart, but better. No, Fred Meyer. No, no, I'm talking about what Forrest is. Oh, okay. Yeah. We're literally just a bunch of night people talking about grocery store. Grocery <laughs> store. <laughs> I like to shop at the old Safeway, get some coupons. Let me tell you about the rotisserie chickens. <laughs> <laughs> My mom goes to H-E-B or Habits in Texas where she goes. I heard that's like the ultimate grocery store. That's, that's like, what my mom like said. the best one. They have everything. Speaking of grocery stores, so I have a question for the chat. <laughs> what is... What are you laughing at? We miss something. What are they doing? Ooh, Carco. I heard about one of your uh, potential <laughs> trades with Eve Claire. Ooh. Chat. Those are always interesting. <laughs> okay, you know thermos bottles? Like, like Steve, you kind of have like little ones. What is the best brand of thermos? Like, that will keep your thermos. drink cold for days. I can't speak to an actual thermos, but if you want like a the best tumbler out there, it's this. It's called uh, Slim, I think. These will hold ice and probably for four or five days. Oh, okay. See, it's I got... The, it's the one. best one ever. This is a Yeti. It works okay. It'll keep ice for like a few hours. There's a brand on Amazon called Beast. Uh, that one sucks. It doesn't keep things cold at all. I have a... I use... If I really need to keep something cold for a while, I use a thermo flask. But every, those went out of popularity when everybody started getting on the Stanley ones. Stanley. Illuminati. Yeah. Thank you, buddy. Who got it? Good, thank you. Thank you. Yeti and thermo. This Yeti cup one is okay. Thermos, though, I'd be willing to try Yeti thermos. Urban got it. Stanley. Yeti. Yeti. Maybe I'll have to try Yeti Thermos. I think the problem with like these cups is it comes with a clear lid, and that's not really a good insulator. Whereas a Thermos, you know, sealed all the way. Stanley. I'm staying away from Stanley right now, though. Stanley Man. The red ones that will kill you, which is Stanley. Plastic? Oh, don't you want to be like insulated? Hydro flask. I was given one. Mm. A hydro flask would keep ice for a long time. Yeah. But my kids stole it. So, <laughs> of course. Yeah, that one. That was a good one. What a Illuminati. Coleman, Yeti, Arctic, Stanley. All the same. You're on your own. See, that's, that's what I was going for. We're heading into summertime. So I was looking for 
like I could read the reviews, but if you guys have already tested one that you like, I'm looking for one that'll last in the summertime. I mean that one that you paid like six hundred and forty three dollars for in Roswell isn't the best one you've ever owned? It's good. <laughs> it's good. It'll hold ice for like a day, maybe two, if it's not too hot. We but, we were almost like, across state lines. And Maddie made me make a U turn so we could go back <laughs> and spend like it was like almost eight hundred bucks. That nine hundred bucks was worth it though. And that's kind of why I don't want to use it. I mean you buy a twelve hundred dollar thermos, you don't you don't want to scratch it, so <laughs> you know what? Let me go show you guys that fourteen hundred dollar thermos beer bag. When he gets back, it's going to be sixteen hundred dollars. <laughs> <laughs> he had like two days to buy it, or like a full day. We were heading out of town, and he's like, "You know what? Can we stop back by there? I, I think I definitely want to get it." <laughs> We were already taking off. Hundred dollars, <laughs> Sharif. This twenty-one hundred dollar thermos, <laughs> wild gear. But it says Roswell and it has a UFO. <laughs> it was is it, the. Is it spelled correctly? Because if it's yeah, not, that'd be w even... kind of like the W is kind of different, but. Okay. It almost looks like it's Rost Hell. But That's what like, I was thinking. <laughs> well. But for $3,000, it works pretty good. <laughs> well, hey, right. fellas. Uh, I'm going to have to drop off here for a little bit. What? I, I got to go, gonna... go make some dinner for the kiddo. I'm uh, I'm also fading quite a bit. I uh-huh. uh, This is bullcrap. I think I need to catch a nap before I go uh, to the gym tonight. If I'm going to end up going to the gym, so... I forgot right. to how late it was. Let's end it then. Oh, well, you don't have to end it. I am not being by myself. Everyone, thank you for coming. Stanley, okay. Oh, I'm trying to Stanley. But everyone, thank you for coming. Move. Or is there anyone else that wants to come up? That's all right. No, Maddie just said F you guys. No. <laughs> but everyone, I hope... Uh, like to catch a nap before bed. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone, have an awesome evening. Ooh, a month. Thank you, Blade Walker. Thank you. They say boo or boo er. Oh, Winchester just showed up, too. Oh. King Pope, how you doing, King, buddy? King, King Pope. How's it going? <laughs> you know, this guy right here is getting quite a, a Strider collection going down here. Mm. National nap time. Thank you, Drink Water. Oh, and TZ, boo! Who earns? <laughs> but thank you guys, everyone. Mm-hmm. And uh, I'm going to put this link again. You guys definitely need to check it out. This is uh, Double D doing his uh, benefit stuff. Double D. Cavity, hello. And good night. <laughs> uh, 19 months. Yeah, I have to do a Get 24 Gary. thing. I have a $50 <laughs> for 150 <laughs> That's hilarious. Well, thank you guys for coming. Uh, everyone right, have a good I night. I need to kill the stream. Bye, everybody.